Marsh, a tough one to take that. Yeah, um, I thought we did pretty well in the game. I think um, Scrap eight times, obviously Derby sometimes um, doesn't get going. Two early penalties was a was strange start to the game, but um, yeah, I think we had probably the best chances overall and, and got in some good positions, but um, obviously sucker punch and gutted at the end. That's thing you mentioned, it was a bit frantic at the start and derbies tend to be that way. Did it feel that way on the pitch? Was it a bit chaotic? Yeah, um, obviously they, they miss a penalty and it gives us a lift and then we go up the other end of the pitch five minutes later and um, a good chance blocked and a pen and, and Martins usually. To be fair, it was, it was a, a, a half-decent penalty and a good save, but um, yeah, it just strange start. I think it, it took everybody in the stadium and the players a um, bit of a while to settle after that. I don't think the quality was that good first half, um, but overall I think we... We, we played relatively well, um, but yeah, it's just gotten to lose a derby. That's it. I mean, we did play well, but how important is it now to put this result aside and focus entirely on Motherwell next week, especially before the winter break and get three points there? Of course, yeah. I think the, we've been consistent since the managers came in. I think this is the first time we've lost at home under the manager, so we have to keep that going. We have to be um, good um, with the setback against St. Johnson which was disappointing, but we need to um, be consistent against the rest of the teams in the league. Obviously lost our first three games of the season, so you feel as if you're a bit um, ch chasing your tail a bit in terms of the points tally, but um, if we can continue um, to believe in the process, believe in how we're playing and how consistent we've been under the manager, um, there's plenty of time in the season to, to, to make it successful. Cheers, Dave. Thank you. Cheers.